Good morning, everyone. This is Prem's crypto market update for March 14th, 2019. Welcome, everyone. If you look at the coin market cap, we're 1 billion down, we're at 134 billion. Um, looking at the volume, still high at 30 billion. Bitcoin is still hovering around the $3,900 level. And if you can see, we the top 10 basically slightly red, slightly green. So it's a mixed bag. Um, one of the things we can definitely see, Stellar is up 4%. 4% doing 10 cents right now and Bitcoin Cash is up 3% doing 132. Um, the coins which have done very well, we can see Wax up 31%, Diamond, Bitcoin Diamond 23% up, Electronium 12% up, Digitex Futures 10% up and Qcoin 9% up. The coins which have not done that well are Komodo 17% down, Project Pi 14% down, Zcoin 11% down and Raven 10% down. So yeah, it's a mixed bag uh, uh, in, in the markets, uh, but you know, uh, Bitcoin is still st keeping steady at this $3,900 level. And if we can see yesterday, a doji was created again, and the stochastics touched again each other. So there could be a reversal on its way for the upward pressure we just had, that we have now a downward pressure. Right now, Bitcoin on Bitstamp is doing 38.48. Now, if you look what's going on with Tron, Tron's dApps are soaring. So uh, in the last week only, the number of transactions, so not the price of Tron, but really the transactions are going skyrocketing. It surpassed 2 million on mainnet user accounts. So that is fantastic. And they did an upgrade to Odyssey 3.5. Uh, so, I mean, these guys are really moving on in the dApp world, leaving Ethereum and uh, EOS behind. The next news comes from Coinbase. Coinbase is about to list Stellar Lumens uh, on their Coinbase Pro, which is basically for the professionals uh, kind of uh, thing. So let's see how this is going to roll. I think this is phenomenal news. Then the next news is from Basel Committee, sets out guidelines for banks intending to enter crypto market. The Basel Committee has laid out guidelines for banks to plan out to enter cryptocurrency market while outlining the supported threats posed by crypto assets in terms of financial stability, committee, uh, and um, expects banks that are going to have direct exposure to crypto industry is prudent. I think this is also big news because the in Bank of International St Settlements have been always basically kind of uh, laid back, but now they understand that crypto is here to stay. This was our news for today. I hope you like it. Please like and subscribe. Go to our website, bitcoinmagazine.nl, and I hope to see you on the next one.